Monsignor Robert Weiss of the St. Rose Parish here in Newtown. Thank you for joining us this morning. I know you spent the night with a lot of the families in that firehouse. How are they doing? You know, uh, we went to, actually went to their homes uh, early this morning to confirm the death of their children, and it was just horrible. You know, the, the, the uncertainty, even though they knew in their hearts that this was real, and the questions they were asking, the regrets they had, you know, why did I send my child to school today? And the parents were just sharing, you know, kind of the last moments they had with their children. One of the dads shared how, uh, for some reason, the child got up early and just came down and told the father how much, you know, she loved him. Or another one that said that just the day before, the child asked him, what is dying like? So parents are really going through a tremendous amount of pain and hurt right now, trying to deal with not just their own personal loss, but what happened to their child in the last moments of their life. And they found out for sure only early this morning? Early this morning, yes. We were gathered here until almost after midnight, and then we were sent out uh, with teams to go to the homes of, uh, of the victims. How do you begin to console a mother or father after something like this? You know, uh, yesterday when I, I met with the people that, that were from our parish, they just said, thank you for your presence. You know, it's just settling in now, and, and certainly the hurt and the anguish, and then there's going to be the anger, and then there's going to have to live with the reality that, that this big part of their life is gone from them. And so many of these families are actually part of your parish. A number of these families are members of our parish community, yes, yes. So you baptize these kids? I have baptized a couple of them. Uh, they go to our, some of them went to our nursery school. Uh, some of them attend religious education at our parish, um, preparing for First Holy Communion. Uh, you know, it's. It's just hard to believe that these little children uh, are gone. And when the families turn to you and say, why? Right. And you know, uh, there's no answer to that question. Th this was not God's plan. This was a, a man who has serious issues in his life. Why he'd want to destroy innocent children, I, I, no one can figure out. And that's the one question people ask at a time like this, and no answer ever really comes back to them. It's, it's just something they have to live with. Monsignor, thank you for joining thank us you this morning. You. You know, we're, we're grieving with you. Uh, I appreciate it.